Gail's Family of In Context Knowledge Portals is an engaging online experience for those seeking contextual information on the most significant topics, people, and events. On each topic page, you'll find a topic overview, viewpoint articles including featured viewpoints selected by editors, full-text newspapers, magazines, and academic journal articles, reference materials, statistics, images, video audio, and links to vetted websites. The top or most recent results for each content type are displayed, along with the number of documents found for each. You can browse the page for results, select a content type from the On This Page list to jump directly to results for that content type or click on a heading to see a complete list of results for that content type. If you arrive at a document from a search, your search term is highlighted in the text. If your library also subscribes to the Gale Virtual Reference Library, also known as GVRL, depending on the contents of your library's GVRL collection, you may also find links within the body of your in-context document to related articles in GVRL eBooks. When viewing a document, click the Listen button to hear the document read aloud. Advances in the life sciences may gradually put bioweapon capabilities closer within terrorist reach, but scientific and technological progress alone doesn't warrant exaggeration of the bioterrorist threat. Use the Seek bar to skip ahead in the reading. Click the speaker icon to adjust the volume. Click the Settings icon to adjust the speed and text highlighting. Click the download icon to download an mp3. When saving the file, you can change the file name. However, be sure to keep the .mp3 extension at the end of the file name. To listen to only part of the text, use your mouse to highlight a portion of the text and then click listen to hear only that portion read. When viewing a document, a variety of tools may be available, including citation tools, email and download options, tools for highlighting note-taking and saving, as well as a translation feature. Click the Citation Tools icon to generate a citation in MLA or APA formats, or to export the citation for use in a third-party citation tool. Click the email icon to send a copy of the document to yourself or someone else. You can select the email format, the content and citation formats you want to include in the email. Click the download icon to download a PDF or HTML version of the document. Click the print icon to print the document. To highlight a passage or make your own annotation, first use your mouse to highlight a block of text. Next, select Highlight from the pop-up menu and select a color for the highlighted text, or select Notes to enter an annotation. Later, when you want to view, email, download, or print your highlights and notes, select More from the product banner, and then select Highlights and Notes. Click the Save icon to save the article in your My folder and return to it later. To view your saved documents, select More from the Resource Banner and then select My Folder. Click the Share icon to share the document on social media. Or click Translate and then select a language from the pull-down menu to translate the article into another language. Click Related Subjects to view a list of topics also covered in the current document. Select a topic to view results for that topic. 